Hello everyone, and welcome to our festive video guide on the 7 Secret Santa Rules for the Workplace. The holiday season is upon us, and what better way to spread cheer than with a secret Santa exchange at the office? Let's dive into the do's and don'ts to make this experience memorable for everyone involved. The first rule of Secret Santa is to set clear guidelines. This ensures everyone is on the same page. Make sure to establish a budget that suits everyone's comfort level. It's not about the price tag, it's about the thought behind the gift. Communication is key, so use tools like anonymous suggestion boxes or online surveys to gather preferences and wish lists. Rule number two, inclusivity matters. Consider cultural and personal differences when organizing the secret Santa. Be mindful of religious holidays and dietary restrictions when selecting gifts. You want everyone to feel included and valued. Encourage creativity and diversity in the gift-giving process to make the experience richer for everyone. Moving on to rule number three, keep it professional. While the holiday season is a time for celebration, remember you're still in a workplace setting. Avoid gifts that may be inappropriate or offensive. Stick to neutral and universally appreciated items to maintain a positive and respectful environment. Rule number four is all about the magic of secret Santa matching. Use a fair and random method to assign gift givers and receivers. This could be drawing names from a hat, using online tools, or even an office-wide event. The element of surprise adds to the excitement, and it ensures that everyone gets a gift without any awkwardness. Now, let's talk about rule number five, respect anonymity. The secret and secret Santa is there for a reason. Once names are drawn, keep the identity of the gift giver hush-hush. This adds an element of mystery and delight to the gift exchange. No peeking or prodding allowed, let the anticipation build. Rule number six is all about timing. Plan the gift exchange at a time that suits everyone, preferably during office hours. Avoid creating additional stress during the busy holiday season. Whether it's a festive lunch, a coffee break, or an end-of-year party, choose a moment that allows everyone to participate and enjoy the experience. Last but certainly not least, rule number seven, show gratitude. Regardless of the gift, express appreciation for the thought and effort put into it. A simple thank you can go a long way. Remember, the spirit of giving is what makes the holiday season special, and acknowledging the effort of your colleagues creates a positive and joyful workplace. There you have it, our seven secret Santa rules for the workplace. Follow these guidelines, and you're sure to unwrap joy and create lasting memories with your colleagues. From all of us here, happy holidays, and may your workplace be filled with warmth, laughter, and the spirit of giving.